Hello football fans. The Football Moments news channel once again has collected the hottest information from different world editions. In this video, Diego Costa is a new Wolves star. Man United ready for contract talks with Rashford. Inter unsure on Lukaku future. Newcastle in advanced talks for Karius. Potter is a new Chelsea coach. Klopp could be the next sacked manager. And other stories. Thanks to you, we are moving very quickly to 1000 subscribers. It means we are on the right way and you like watching the latest news and rumors from the world of football. And if you have not subscribed yet, be sure to click the subscribe button. Then we would add even more fresh football news. Jordan Pickford has been one of the few shining lights for Everton in the last 12 months. Although, they'll have to cope without him for the next few weeks as he has picked up a thigh injury. With Andy Lonergan also injured, many might have expected him to turn to the free agent market to source a short-term replacement, but David Ornstein has claimed that such an eventuality is extremely unlikely. Wolves have successfully appealed their failure to gain a work permit for the transfer of Diego Costa. As reported by Fabrizio Romano, the first part of medical ongoing for Costa and work permit issue has been sorted. Deal now only depends on medical tests. Contract until June 2023. Juventus are eager to sign Aston Villa's Douglas Lewis in the winter transfer window and can also add Moise Keane in the deal, according to a report by Juve Live. Arsenal were also interested in the Brazilian but saw three deadline day bids rejected with the final bid worth £25 million. Manchester United are set to open negotiations with Marcus Rashford over a possible contract extension, as reported by The Sun. The England international can be offered a five-year contract to fend off interests from PSG and other clubs. Inter Sporting Director Giuseppe Marotta has admitted that he does not know how Thomas Tuchel's departure will affect the future of Blues loanee Romelu Lukaku. Lukaku's future to change after Tuchel's sack. Too early, we'll see with Chelsea at the end of the season, he told reporters. Newcastle are in advanced talks to sign former Liverpool goalkeeper Loris Karius following an injury to Carl Darlow in training yesterday. Karius is a free agent after his Liverpool contract ended in the summer. He spent the last two years on loan at Besiktas and Union Berlin. The 29 year old is already in Newcastle to undergo a medical and sign a short term deal. Newcastle have been forced to act after Darlow tore ankle ligaments in a morning session yesterday. He faces some time on the sidelines. Newcastle are unable to recall Martin Dubravka until January under the terms of his Manchester United deadline day loan deal. So, Darlow's injury has left Newcastle short of a number two goalkeeper. Graham Potter looks set to be edging closer to becoming Thomas Tuchel's successor at Chelsea. According to Fabrizio Romano, he is expected to be announced as the new manager at Stamford Bridge after holding positive talks with the club's hierarchy this morning. Potter and his assistant Billy Reid have now left the Brighton training ground. He spent two hours inside saying goodbye to the players and staff. Chelsea's managerial change will cost the club over £22 million. Just over £15 million to pay Graham Potter's release clause and almost £7 million in compensation for Thomas Tuchel. The odds on Jurgen Klopp to become the next Premier League manager sacked have slashed dramatically following Liverpool's shock 4-1 defeat to Napoli in the Champions League on Wednesday evening. The odds were 66-1 prior to kick-off, but then became just 12-1 after a miserable night in Naples for the Reds that saw them 4-0 down inside 47 minutes. The result compounds Liverpool's turbulent start to the Premier League season, after defeats to rivals Manchester United and draws with Fulham, Crystal Palace and neighbours Everton in recent weeks left them six points behind leaders Arsenal. And the pressure appears to be mounting on Klopp following the dismissal of his compatriot, Thomas Tuchel. What do you think about Liverpool's future and what Klopp should do resolve his problems? Have your say. Write your comments below. That is all for today. If you prefer our video be sure to subscribe and click the like button to support football moments. See you soon.